Can you make me feel like a rebel? But I will not hey guys, give you how a are you today? Um, so welcome to our new vlog video. Um, second ever video. So I hope you enjoyed my first one of the full body bro session. Um, so normally I wouldn't work out like that. I'd normally normally I do a full day, five day split. So it'd look something like. Monday would be chest, um, Tuesday legs, Wednesday back, Thursday shoulders, and Friday's arms, which is today. So, it's Easter long weekend. I have today off of work, so I'm going to make the most of it with a big arm session. Um, before we get started, I'm going to run you through what I've been having for breakfast or what I'm going to have for breakfast today um, what I take in the mornings normally um, and prepping up towards my session so before I do I'm going to show you what I have to deal with every single day so across the road there is the Arnott's Biscuit Factory come out in the mornings and all I can smell is biscuits, delicious biscuits. It's not easy when you're dieting here. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so, alright, gonna have breakfast and then we'll get into it. Alright guys, so we've got everything set out for my breakfast. Um, the kitchen's a little bit cleaner than what it would normally be. Um, that's probably because my housemates aren't here. They're on holiday. <laughs> <laughs> so um, I like to keep my shit clean um, but anyway I'm going to have this morning some oats um, just the Coles brand rolled oats uh, probably put in about 80 to 100 grams of this followed up with for a bit of flavour I like to add in well I've got here some white chocolate protein peanut butter spread all right so it's got a fair bit of fat in it but that's all right because you need your fats in the mornings um, and then i'm going to mix that up with some low fat low carb maple syrup all right so we're going to put them in together mix it up and pour it all over the oats it's going to be delicious and then after that i'm going to Sprinkle some flaked almonds on top and finish up with some frozen blueberries and then eat it, eat it all. Um, so, <clears throat> I got my protein shake ready for after my work. I got here my Vital Greens powder, so mix that up with a glass of water and I'll have that with my vitamins. Uh, my supplements, what I take, so I've got um, over here, these yellow ones here are my fish oil, um, I've got my CLA here, conjugated lyric acid, a multivitamin and also some magnesium. So first we're going to make um, this topping up so I'm going to put in about a tablespoon of this peanut butter spread maybe a little bit more and then what you have to do is add in some hot water boiling water because it's going to be quite thick so you won't be able to mix it up so in a little drop of this. That was probably too much. And then a maple syrup. And then mix it all up. So I'm just going to try and consume a bit more carbs this morning, obviously because I'm training this morning. I'm going to put them to good use. Um, so the oats are done. Give it a mix. Pour in the paste. And the crack 
goodness. Look at it. You get all that paste. That's it. Mm. Now add in the almonds. Like almonds and now finish with the blueberries. Good amount in there. And mix it in. And that's the finished product. So I'm gonna smash that down. Alright guys, we're nearly ready for the gym. Firstly I'm gonna shop my old carnitine before my workout um, the old fashioned way there's only a little bit left in there so I'm just gonna scull it straight out the out the container yuck so if you haven't tried that before it's not very good it's really like, it's like vinegar or something, but it's not good. It's yuck. And then my pre-workout slash fat burner. So Scorch by Man Sports. Um, it's a bubblegum flavour. It's very sweet to drink, so I like to just scull it also and get it out of the way. So we take a scoop of that. Ready to go, let's go do it. Um, I made my lunch as it's um, <laughs> Good Friday. Wait, let me put my seatbelt on. Uh, it's Good Friday, so apparently I'm not allowed to eat meat, so I've decided to make tuna for lunch, tuna salad. So, here yeah, you might be able to see. Just look, look at that. <laughs> Alright guys, so today with my arm workout, with that, I'm going to be splitting between my bicep and tricep exercises. So, you can do arms two ways where you can do alternating between bicep exercise to tricep exercise. So that's a good way in maintaining a, a pump throughout your workout. But today what I'm going to do is really try and focus on each muscle group a bit more and fatigue them out a little bit more um, by splitting them. So what I'll do is I'll go through all my bicep exercises first and really really try and fatigue them and get that pump and then move on to my tricep exercises. Alright guys, this is my home gym. So today I have my friend Asad here training with us. Say hello Asad. Hey. Uh, <laughs> uh, didn't expect the gym to be so busy today, but we just got along with it. Uh, so we're going to start off with just cable curls. We do a warm up set. And we're going to build up in weight each set. So one medium, one heavy, and then a drop set. So drop three drops. So start the warm up. Don't stop, don't stop, don't stop, don't stop, don't stop. Alright, so, so I'm on my third set. Um, a bit heavier now, so looking for 8 to 10 reps. Really want to focus still, even though it's heavier, really want to focus on squeezing the biceps at the top of the movement and get that full range of movement, so extending your arms fully at the bottom and all the way up, but making sure that we're keeping our elbows in, locked in, we're not bringing our elbows back, we're in that fixed position, all right? Set, um, doing a drop. 
up set now, so we're going to start heavy, aim for that 8 to 10 reps, and then drop the weight, go again, try and beat that, so a few extra reps, go to failure, then one more drop after that, finish off for us. Don't stop, stop.
the, the curled bar, but we only have the straight bar available, so we're going to use that. And the idea of this is to make sure your elbows are straight. You don't want them coming out inwards, to keep them straight. So that force is going to come behind your head, extend all the way up to squeeze your tries, alright? So we're going to do
so that's my arm workout done for today. Um, hope you enjoyed it. Um, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel. Um, follow my Instagram, Kyle Bryant Online PT. Um, give Asad a follow as well. His is Asad Fitness World, I believe. Um, and make sure you drop a comment. Uh, give me some feedback and let me know what you'd like to see in my next video. So thanks for watching and see you next time.